Ladies and gentlemen, let's get ready to rumble! Hello guys and welcome back to Sinbin Breaks. Today we are jumping into the subscription box um, program I guess. We decided to, after watching some videos and seeing a lot of different companies out there, watch some videos on this one, the Collectible Card Club. They have a variety of different, um, different products, obviously different subscription levels. Um, for us, it was more reasonably priced than some of the others out there, especially the ones coming from Canada for the number of packs you get versus the cost of the box. So we decided to try this one out, see what we could do. Um, this one, there's three different tiers to it. I think it's a five car, a five pack, 10 pack and 15 pack, um, 35, 45 and 60, I believe is what it is. So we did the, um, 15 pack, we did the platinum and we figure for 60 bucks with uh, 15 packs and we've seen some really nice packs coming out of this we'd give it a shot so without further ado let's see what packs are in store for us today okay so let's go to this side over here so on the first stack there is 2021 OPG hobby 1112 SP authentic 1112 SPX tops traded rookies which we've seen this a lot and 1920 MVP let's go to this side here and this one we've got 2021 series 2 so maybe a Kirill or a Stutzel maybe a Laffy in series 1 and those are these are all hobby it looks like um, 15, 16, OPC, 0607 Power Play, 2005 Pacific. So, I'm not sure how we're going to do this. We've seen it break it done a couple of different ways. So we're going to kind of let's see what uh, what options we get, and we'll kind of go from there. So uh, back there, and in the middle. Oh, 1516 OPG Platinum, another 1920 MVP, 2001, 2000, 2001 Tops, another OPG 1920, and then another 2021 Hobby. So, not the best packs we've seen out of this product, but definitely not the worst. Um, I think we're going to do this by, um, let's see, we'll do do it sort of by year and then we'll do it by product Let's do it. kind of go best to worst or worst to best so to say all right so don't know really what to expect but like i said 15 packs 60 bucks shipped um definitely not a bad a uh, bad item so we'll just uh rip these up and let's see what we get so 01 2000 2001 tops okay let's say you're probably going to be sticky so dimitri kalanen nhl prospects willie mitchell hard to see Mike Dunham, I'm going to change this light for just a second and see if we can get this little looking a little bit better for you guys. As I am having a hard time seeing this, and I'm betting you guys are too. That's a little bit better. All right, Mike Dunham. Hey, Jeremy Roenick. Not too bad. I don't think this is a rookie card. A young ones of Joe Thornton and Vinny Le Cavalier. 
Martin Rusinski, Pat Verbeek, Anson Carter, Tom Poti, Poti Poti, and Clem Johansson or Clem Johnson. So, and the checklist. Okay, no, didn't know what to expect there, so that's all right. Another tops pack here, 0304 traded rookies. Let's see what this bad boy holds. Roman Chechmanic. Jeff Gillison. Mike Greer. Julian Vauclair. Okay. Antoine Vermeet, Matt Murley, Paul Martin, and Dominic Moore. I don't know that any of those are anything special. Some of these older products, I don't really know um, as far as if there's any decent cards in there or not. So kind of just winging it unless I see something that catches my eye. And this was 2005 Pacific Hockey. All right, so we got Martin Skula, Stevie Eiserman, Dustin Brown, and this is Global Connection, Henrik Zetterberg and Pavel Datsuk. Not too bad. Zdeno Chara, when he was on the Senators. Marc-Andre Fleury on the Penguins. And Martin St. Louis for the Lightning. Kind of fun. I like some of these older cards. They have just a, a nice look to them. Something different than what we're seeing these days. Kind of brings back the old uh, um, baseball, football cards of the late 90s. Just something kind of different and neat. So. Uh, this one is 0607 Power Play. I don't think this particular product had a long run. If I remember hearing um, hearing one of the other guys talk about it, but um, we'll see what we get. So, Miroslav Satan, Hanu Toivonen, Steve Sullivan, Brendan Morrison, Marian Hossa, and goal robbers of Jean Sebastian Giguere. So, so far, nothing real crazy, nothing, nothing too exciting, but not bad, not kind of fun getting into some of the older stuff. So now let's go into 1920 MVP. With this, you're kind of looking for super scripts, puzzle backs. Um, those are kind of the biggies in this. Every once in a while, you get a nice numbered card. So we got Timo Meyer, Darnell Nurse, Natty Mac, Eric Brandstrom. Sid the Adult, and that's a checklist. Kevin LeBanc, Jimmy VC, and Alex Galchenyuk. So, base pack on that one. So far, a lot of base packs, so hopefully we'll get something uh, something halfway decent out of these next few packs we got to do. So. Caught a hot. Taylor Hall. Anders Lee. Cam Atkinson, a silver skit script of Vinny Trocheck, Justin Schultz, Matt Zuccarillo, and Ty Ratty. Yeah, nothing real great there either. Didn't expect much. 1516 OPG. Not sure. Oh, this is a weird pack. It's almost like paper, but it's not. Don't really know what to expect in this. Oh, well, there you go. Ryan Kessler. He's <laughs> trying to. Where's, oh, oh, okay, well, we do have something here. Shoot, I thought that was like cards stuck together. So we got Pavel Datsuk, Ryan Kessler, I think it's this way. Ooh, yeah. Oh, sweet, Steven Express Stamkos. Man. Yeah, All right. baby. <laughs> That's kind of cool. Manufactured hockey patch. That's kind of dope. We actually, we had an, an Avs, the Avs logo in OPG. So I wonder why the pack felt so weird. I'm like, well, 
maybe maybe it was a bunch of cards stuck together so all right i'll leave that bad boy up there that's all right we'll take that nice little hit for the for the night now let's go into 1920 opg maybe we'll get lucky with somebody we got a tall boy it looks like all right sammy vontanen colin wilson Derek brassard Andre Sequeira, Travis Konechny, oh, a Jonathan Taves. I think these are called the Caramel Tall Boy. Not bad. Jordy Ben Retro, Marky Rookie of Philip Zadina, Anton Strawman, and Marcus Nidavara. Not too bad. Okay. Those Tall Boys are kind of cool. I will say that. Now we got 1920 pack number two. Let's see if we can get, we got another tall boy in here. I don't know if those tall boys come in every pack or not. I don't think so, but we'll take it. So we got Carey Price, Jonas Brodin, another Travis Konechny, Ivan Provorov, a tall boy of Sebastian Ajo. Sweet. Two decent tall boys there. Matt Martin Retro. Blue of Michael Grabner. No, these were not numbered. I can't remember. Danny DeKaiser, Riley Smith, and a checklist. All right, so now we're getting into the fun ones. Um, obviously, Laffy. We're hoping to hoping to get one of those. Um, be nice to get a canvas or something like that, but we'll see. A young gun of any kind would be phenomenal, and I don't. I don't know. Nick Felino, Jared Spurgeon, Charlie Coyle, and a um, Martin Cout Young Gun. Sweet. We'll take that. I think we have one, but hey, we'll take that. Absolutely. Anze Kopitar, Brendan Tanev, Mark Stone, and Alex Stalock. All right. Now, let's see if we can have some luck with. Uh, Two more young guns, preferably Kirill, the I might be going back to Russia, and Stutzla. So, OEL, Kevin LeBanc, Kyle Connor, Tucker Pullman, and a Calfoot young gun regular, which we have one already, which is okay. We have the regular and the French. Dennis Garyanov, Dustin Brown, and Josh Bailey. So I think, I mean, the fact that we're we've got two young guns out of two packs of series one and two, that's I'll take that. Maybe we'll get lucky with a third. Alright. Got the flower. Anders Bjork. Jeff Skinner. And <laughs> Chase Prisky, young gun. I mean Three young guns out of three random packs. Yeah, give it to me. I'll take it. Derek Ryan, Andrew Maggiapani, Richard Panic, and Chandler Stevenson. All right. So, the SP Authentic. I think that one has a filler in there. So, I'm going to do OPG Platinum last. I don't, I know the one of one has been pulled. Um, and I know a couple of the other ones have been pulled too, so not really expecting anything from a um, <clears throat> McDavid standpoint, but we'll see. So this was 1112 SPX. So we've got OEL, Jared Stahl, Jordan Stahl, Blocker, and it looks like we've got just a base pack. I thought these had, I think these came, I thought these came five cards, but maybe not. I could be wrong. So we do have a base pack of 1112 SPX. Now, maybe we'll get lucky with 1112 SP Authentic. I can't remember if this year had, yep, yeah, it had blockers. I was like, I couldn't remember if this year had blockers in it or not, but apparently it does. So we'll take this up, take the blocker out. I think we just got a base pack, but we'll see. Nick Lidstrom, Dan Cleary, looks like a Wings box, Trevor Lindgren, Linden, Martin St. Louis, and Mike Murray. Yep, a. I think you've been cheated! Sorry, so a base pack. 
Okay, come on, OPG Platinum. Let's let's get some heat in here, man. I'd be nice little orange checkers or something would be really nice, really cool. So, or an auto. Okay, so Steven Stamkos, Mike Bossy, Legend, Josh what? Anderson, Retro, and Jacob De La Rosa, De La Rose, Retro uh, Rookie. So. Not the best, uh, not the best packs in the world, but overall, three young guns, that cool Stamco's card, a couple of tall boys in there. I mean, for sixty bucks, we you could spend a lot more, a lot less money, or a lot more money on a lot less, uh, less fun product. So, um, we'll be doing this once a month. Have the um, uh, we did the the monthly subscription, so we're kind of excited about it. Uh, I know what some of the other subscription, you know, ones like Gold Box, you get the potential to hit like a, I think this month's or June's was a, um, uh, what was it, a Black uh, Limited of McDavid and I think Crosby maybe, um, possibly, something like that. But I mean, you know, for the money... This is a fun rip. We've seen some really nice cards come out of there. Um, I know recently I'd seen 1314 Panini Prism in here, which, you know, at $600 a box or more, that's kind of a nice little pack to get in here, get in for a chance at something. So anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed it. Remember to like and subscribe and hit the little bell icon so you can be notified when we upload. We do try to upload on Saturdays. Uh, as of filming of this, we are at 600 or 600. <laughs> I wish we were at 650 subscribers. We're at 350 subscribers, and we'll be doing a 400 subscriber giveaway. Probably going to be doing a retail box of maybe series two, one or two. Um, might do something different, but right now that's kind of what we're what we're thinking. So um, if you have subscribed, uh, keep an eye out for when we start making those announcements as far as what to do and um, how to enter. If you know people who you think would enjoy the content, enjoy the channel, please help them, you know, get them to subscribe so they can be part of the, uh, the giveaway and, um, you know, maybe get, uh, maybe get a box of cards on us. So, well, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed. Be looking for this uh, every month, at least for a while. We're going to keep giving it a shot. And remember, it's always good to be in the sin bin. That's all, folks.